Hi guys, so welcome back to another video. Sorry, I was gonna close my door. Um, welcome back to another video. Yeah, I'm just from the stream. This little stream. Um, today I'm gonna show you. Um, so I have made so there's a plain little set, which is it's a city life set. It's quite expensive, so I've decided to make my own, and it's a pet shop, and uh, like a clothing store and like a sports store. So I've, I've decided to make my own, because why not? And I thought I wanted one, so I, mean, I don't really have the money, so I guess I could make one out of my own. Out of my own stuff. Okay. Hope you like this. We are going to start at the pet store and work our way to the sports store. Enjoy this. Okay, so here's... So this is like the entrance to... Um, the pet store so we've got like a little office and like a fine place and all, like a dog leash hanged up and then here are the dogs they're a bit crowded so i kind of feel sorry for them and then we've got these guys i can name them for you i, I, I know all their names so this is luna sandy moon trev bendy uh popcorn i think her name's sunny and then underneath the little yellow tail or golden tail, that is uh, Sunset. And then that is Pitch. That's a big night, the big black one. And then that's Biscuit. Yes, yeah, so that's the dogs. <laughs> They're a bit crowded. And then moving on from the dogs, there's a little pond. And then there's an outside area for the bench and the balloon. A <laughs> small outside area for you to like, like, go test for the dogs or whatever. And then moving on, there is a small storage area, and then there's a place up here which has a case and a bag and like a little stool. Um, but this place is owned um, on top, so it's not the actual pet store's like area, it's someone else's. And so they've just put that stuff up there. Um, well, the it's takes these two, these two people own here, and they are looking around. She really wants a pet, but she doesn't want a dog. So she's looking at the cats and like small stuff. There's this stuff with a bowl, food, a brush, and toys, and a collar in like a box area. And there's a woman here who's looking at the kitten. She is one of the owners, and so is her. She's the other owner. Um, there should be two workers at each shop, apart from the fashion one. For some reason, that one only has one worker. Um, so yeah, she's looking at like the food area and then she's looking at this amazing cute cute cat so this cat is smoky and then this one i can't remember what they named it i think it was like i can't remember so we're just gonna rename her mitting and then this is moonshine mitting's mother and then this is kate and this is this is gonna call it Blossom for now. This is Markski. Well her surname is Markski. And then this is I think Blossom's sister Violet. Yeah, so yeah. I don't know her name. Let's call her Becky. Um okay. Uh moving on to the fashion store. It's quite big so we can't really forget England for apart from if we go sideways um so over here we have the little desk it has two amazing beautiful necklaces and a very expensive watch and this woman who is at the desk with her computer and yeah she's got some money down there because I don't have a cash register. Oh, wait, no. She did have money down there. She's giving it to someone. Um, yeah, we don't have a cash register, but who cares? Um, well, nothing can fit in the drawer. And then these two are standees. So they're, like, outfits. So if they want to, like, try on a dress or something, then they have to change into these two outfits. Um, and then there's some bags over here, which are free. Um, they're, like, free bags. If you buy something big, then you get this one. Or something small, you get that one. And then here's a bag rack. They are... 59 whatever m i don't know what the currency i was just i guess it's m because that's something else uh yeah so that's 59 and then there's a bunch of bags there's a cake bag 
there's like a hang bag and then there's like a shoulder bag and then there's like this bag and then we have this woman and she's got some money in her hand she's got 50 um and she's sitting on this extremely expensive couch because why not um and we've got this little desk it's got a camera and like a perfume bottle and a fan so this stuff is quite this this box is expensive but ain't too expensive you know it's not like overpriced but like it's the expensive table then we've got a table with a boy thing out he's got 10 m so he's more looking at the cheaper items and this is a little table with some scuff what kids can afford there is a hairbrush toy boat um a collar and a purse and some flowers which aren't for sale and a pair of knucklers this kid is i don't know what he's wanting probably not the hairbrush i don't think anyone wants that hairbrush um like it gives a brand new hairbrush but i don't know if anyone wants it and then there is a very expensive chair matching the couch they are matchies and there's this stand. It says 99M for a really, really cute hairdo. Yes, yeah, so if you want this hairdo with like this really cute stuff, um, you have to pay 99M. Quite expensive. And it's the same amount for the dress. 99. Quite expensive. And then there's a little dressing room. And then that is the whole shop. Okay, moving on from the fashion store. We're going to go to the sports one, the last one. So in the sports store we have two people. Um this person talking to a kid and saying, Okay, you can go down the slide, pretty much. Um he's in some sporty wear, she's just in, you know, traditional clothes, just clothes in general. And then we have a like a slide thing with a seesaw and some steps and stuff. Um and we have these two kids, you know, doing what they're living, going on the seesaw. Then we've got these two who are wanting to take a bike and just try it out. So there's four helmets there and two spare. Three kick ones, two child ones spare. And then there is one helmet for a bike, which is an angle bike. And then there's two kick bikes and a scooter. And there's these two kids in wheelchairs. And this boy has been here before, and he is showing his friend, who has broken both their legs, um, to go down this ramp. Um, yeah, sadly they have to pay, which, you know, you could just go to the skate park nearby, but there isn't a skate park nearby, so this is the best thing they can get. And there's also a few bush, and then there's these two people. Yeah. Okay, um, that is this area. Okay, so thanks for watching my video. Hope you liked that. And yeah, thanks. Bye.